Hello everyone and welcome to League of Aram. We're here playing the new champion Jin. And this is uh, he's been released for like five days now. This is the very first time I've ever seen him, so I have no idea what the fuck you build on him or what any of his skills or anything do. Okay. By the looks of his stuff, I did look at it like very slightly. It looks like crit is what you wanna get. But I have no idea. So let's look over his passive. Yep, that's a lot of writing. All of his fucking abilities are like a story. Alright, so his Q, it bounces between like a couple of targets, like five I think. His auto attacks are a bit like Graves, you can't reload between him, you have to fight off every shot, his last one's guaranteed to crit I think. Apparently everyone's fucking left the game, so that's, that's a great start. Uh, the W is like a really, really long... Look how far that range is. It's a really long range fucking... Like... Shot. And I think it stuns them if you were if you shot them or if they step on this thing. And then... Here's... Yeah, oh, that's so fucking... Sh that's like so far. Oh, wow. That did so much damage. Yeah, his W is like this little flower thing that uh, basically like does a lot. Of, it does a lot of damage if it goes off, but it just it's mainly for a slow because people can walk out of it before it even goes off like easily. Uh, but his ultimate is this like massive ranged sniper barrage. Like you fire off like four shots, I think it is. I think the idea between his W and his E is you have the E and you plan your W to hit them as they walk into the E and then you stun them obviously and they take the uh, massive damage from the W. Oh, his reload is so long. Like his reload seriously takes like so long to do. I imagine laning with this guy in an actual game is impossibly hard as an ADC. I think you'd have to go as a solo lane. Like just looking at the length of his reload, you'd never be able to see S correctly, especially with the harassment. Oh, his uh, Q. Every time it kills a minion as it bounces as well, or kills anything as it bounces, it increases in damage. They can get ridiculously strong. So, I've, I've been leveled up for quite a while. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to actually level up, though. Hmm. Oh, I'm, I'm going to go for his W, because it is Aram. Oh, my God. I've... I've actually leveled up twice, I've just been uh, trying to focus on doing other stuff that I've not paid any attention to it. But when I seen this champion, I, I instantly thought I'm going to like this guy because Caitlyn is one of my favourite ADCs. And this guy's basically a weird male, creepy version of Caitlyn, so, you know. Should be good. Oh, God. Oh, I got way too close to Nasus. That was so low health. I didn't have any mana either. This might be good on him. Do I even need... Doesn't something give him movement speed? I, 
I'll try going without boots for this game well, until I desperately need them anyway. Maybe like just stack in movement speed items and crit is the way to go, like Phantom Dancer. This rapid fire cannon that I'm going for. Infinity Edge. Maybe a uh, Essence Reaver might be okay. I'd say it's my first game playing as him, so I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. I will use my uh, ultimate at some point. I bet now. Oh my god! That threw me right fucking off. That massive. That fucking uh, zoom out. That put me right off doing it. Oh, you deal so much damage. Oh, it's crazy. Oh god, where am I? Sorry, I was uh, trying to move my mouse. Oh, okay, she really wants that. I could have made it easy before her. Reload, you son of a bitch, Jen. Oh my god, that reload is incredibly long. That's got to be like a good two and a half seconds. And the main, the main problem is he doesn't reload while he's just walking around, like Graves does. Also, that flower, unless you do what I said and root them, it doesn't seem like you're ever really going to be able to hit them. Well, you're not going to be able to hit them with the flower passive. The active. I don't know what Rumble's doing. Is he good? Apparently Rumble just doesn't want it. But I need mana. So I'm going to grab one of them at least. Is that my explosive? Am I doing like AoE explosive damage with my ult? W wasn't off cooldown, so I couldn't just shoot that out. Yeah, I'm thinking I definitely need to get Essence Reaver, though. I'm so mana hungry. Oh my god, his, his kit deals so much damage, that's incredible. Like, even just not normal auto attacks, like, yeah, he's an ADC, I think they do a lot of damage, but... Oh, he does reload as he's walking around, it just takes him a long fucking time. No, oh, that's good to know. Yeah, you'd think his like, auto attacks do a lot because he's an ADC, but then it's like all his spells do a lot and he's got like amazing range as well. 
Oh, fucking hell. It's really fucking weak, though. I feel like hell. That ultimate does fucking loads. I don't know, that that old, I don't I didn't see how much did like eight hundred damage for one shot. And it does four of them. No more health back here. I don't know where it's going. You can't critically strike towers, obviously. Well. I say obviously, you'd have thought with only four shots you might have been able to. So, uh, maybe you want to save your last, like, if your entire team siege you, maybe you don't want to do that. Maybe you want to save one or two of your shots for the uh, actual enemies when they come up to you. Got him. Bouncing grenade hit him. I don't know what I'm actually supposed to be loving up the end. I'm splitting my points. You don't really ever want to do that unless there's like one of your skills gets a big power spike at some point. Oh look at that fat bar Eat my friend, eat. I wasn't fed it. Kazix, you son of a bitch. I meant to throw the, uh, the little thing out there, by the way, not the, uh, <laughs> not the gun. I'll try to get how to feed the poro. The Poros need the food, damn it. Oh, we can buy so much. doing it. Oh, well, someone's a bastard. Oh, Nasus, you son of a bitch. Yeah, you definitely don't know. Critically strike the towers. Well, that's a short and quick game as Jin. Uh, there wasn't much commentary. There was a bit of trying to feed the Poro. I hope you saw the power in him, though. He's going to be such a strong character for Aram, even when they tone down his numbers, which they will do. Because if he's that strong, he's going to dominate like solo queue. And he's probably going to be really highly sought after in uh, competitive play. But 
even after they tone like tone his numbers down and nerf him to the ground, I still think he's going to be incredibly strong in Aram just because of his range. Like that W, his ult, even though his Lotus Flowers, if you can uh, chain the W into them, they do so much damage anyway. I doubt they'll change those numbers too much. But yeah, that was him. I hope I get a few more games with him. That was my first one. He's really fun to play. Uh, I'd recommend picking him up if anyone else out there uh, sees this video. Hope you join me next time and goodbye.